this is part of the arsenal escort troops confiscated from police stations in Banja Luka. There are fears the hall was to be used by forces loyal to hardliner Radovan Karadzic in a coup attempt against President Biljana Pavzic. True or not, the arms find has been used to her advantage in the political struggle against her rival. At a rally in Banja Luka, Pavzic told thousands of supporters that her opponents were planning to sow bloodshed to hold on to power. She is nurturing public support in the Serb territory's biggest town. But she still faces fierce opposition from hardliners in the current stronghold of Palo, who claim she has betrayed Serbs. Momčilo Krajeznik, a Karadzic supporter, uh, says the recent interference in police matters by Plavzic and to escort troops is unconstitutional. But Western diplomats have backed Plavzic, saying at least she is playing by the rules of danger. The authorities in Pali continue on a repeated basis to try to exercise every anti-democratic trick, maneuver and subterfuge of which they are capable. And a senior Bosnian Serb judge has revealed he was threatened by armed men claiming loyalty to Karadzic. Jovo Rozic says they threatened to kill him unless he voted against Pravzic in a crucial court decision. It's further evidence of the escalation in the tensions in the Serb territory. And while support for Karadzic in Pala is strong, there is great risk that political rivalry will deteriorate into confrontation.